Hey guys, so I wanted to do a video and I just had three things to tell you so I decided to just do a kind of sort of uh, what's in my closet stockpile tour video and combine it with another few things that um, I wanted to tell you. So um, part of me um, getting my life together is organize organizing all of my stuff and so um this is just what I keep in my closet in my room. It's just like lotions and this is just like a little, doesn't have a home. So I throw it in here basket and I did notice that I am down to three of these. Maybe I have them like in my purse and stuff, but I need one of these deals because I never feel right if I don't have like 20 of them. But yeah, so um, this is uh, some perfumes and You'll see that I did open the Nicki Minaj and the Mariah Carey, but I will tell you why I opened them in a second. Um, also, if uh, you did not know, uh, these are also on sale at CVS. The little perfumes there, the little single ones. I think some of them are roll-ons and some of them are sprays, but these are $2.49. I did pick those up today, and I also picked up the Men's Curve. This is $4.99. These Beyonce's, I already had those. I bought those, I think, right after Christmas or during Christmas, but um, yeah, so... Um, Oh, this is from Netta when we did the swap. I haven't used it yet, but I am going to. That's why I have it sitting out and not, like, tucked away somewhere. Um, and here, I know you guys have seen my stockpile tour video before, but this is just stuff that we keep in our closet so we don't have to go out in the garage. But toothpaste and way too many razors. And down here is just girl stuff. A lot of that going on. And... That down there is like, go through that pile when you're still trying to get your life together and trying to figure out where to put all that. But yeah, and just like facial wipes, lotions, and scope, and just a whole bunch of things that we run out of that we just keep in the closet so that we are not going um, to the garage and um yeah and the reason why i ended up putting all my perfumes in here i used to keep them in my restroom but it was kind of overflowing so i decided to put them in here and somebody told me that it wasn't a good idea to keep your perfumes on the sink i can't remember what the reason was but um yeah so it works out better in here anyways only problem is, is i need more light in my closet and all of these deodorants because I guess I just haven't figured out which deodorant that I like better and I just I don't know I just keep them all here this is a sweet card that my hubby gave me I just really like it it's so sweet I just keep it there I think I've had it for like a very long time and I just keep it there but yeah so let me show you what else I wanted to tell you so one major thing was about those check those um, they're on clearance for $2.49. I got the Britney Spears and the Ed Hardy. I have no idea what Ed Hardy smells like, but um, I just rather got those than the other ones that they had available. And let me tell you the other part really quick. Okay, so this is the Britney Spears gift set that um, I got. Oh, okay, baby, you can hold the camera for me. So this is the Britney Spears gift set that, that I got the other day, or yesterday I should say, when I bought the Nicki Minaj and the Mariah Carey. But um, I wanted to open this scent because I really like this one, so I just decided that I was going to open it and just start using it. So when I went to take it out, I could tell that something was a little different, and the reason is it's empty, absolutely empty. There's nothing inside of it, not even like... It doesn't even smell like the perfume. I actually think I just got the dud when the manufacturer was like putting the bottles together. This one just got skipped in the factory. I don't know, but yeah. So it's completely empty. The other two were full and I'm going to have to take it back to the store because um, of course, even though I paid $4.99, I still want my $4.99's worth. So, I know they don't have any more, so I have to see what they're going to do about it. I hate to return it, and then I just let these go to waste, but I don't know. But, yeah, so when I saw that this one was empty, I went ahead and just opened those two. Of course, I knew that the Mariah Carey was full because it's clear and you can see through it, but I just ended up opening all of them. 
and um, I just wanted to tell you guys because I know a lot of you probably will save these for Christmas or give them away as gifts because they're really good gifts but if you bought the Britney Spears one just be on the lookout and make sure that if you can try to see if you can shake the bottle if you can see it through the clear part here just make sure that it's not empty or just make sure all of the perfume gift sets that you got weren't empty this one um, I even checked I had to look back to make sure that it was not open it wasn't even open I was the first person to open it because the first thing I thought was somebody opened it and they took it out and they put an old one back in there that they had but that wasn't the case I was the first person to open it and it was just like a manufacturer error so yeah so that's what I really wanted to tell you guys in the video and also tell you about the um clear the 75 percent off on these and yeah I guess just give you a little stockpile tour of what's in my closet and that's it Mm -hmm. So, I will see you guys later. Bye.